Welcome in everyone to this week's college football resume ranking going into week 11. A uh, lot of shakeups last night and uh, yesterday. A lot of great games. Uh, Ohio State comes in at number one. They have five good wins and no losses. You see their record or their rank, the team, the record, good wins, and their losses over here. Now, the resume ranking had Tennessee at number two above Georgia, so I had to do a manual override there to put Georgia at number two because of the head-to-head. -head. They're right next to each other, head-to-head -head matters in that instance. Georgia is number two. Tennessee is number three, five good wins with the one loss. TCU is number four, four good wins, no losses. Clemson, number five, four good wins, one loss. Michigan, number six, three good wins, no losses. LSU, uh, number seven, four good wins, two losses. Illinois, four good wins, two losses. UCLA, three good wins, one loss. And rounding out the top ten is Louisville. It's a weird resume ranking <laughs> this week. But four good wins and three losses. Number 11 is Alabama, seven and two with three good wins. NC State is seven and two with three good wins. Ole Miss comes in at number 13, two good wins with one loss, same with Oregon and USC. North Carolina as well as Tulane, all two good wins with one loss. Notre Dame comes in at number 18, three good wins and three losses. Texas, the same, three good wins, three losses. Syracuse, three good wins, three losses. And rounding out, I did 22 teams this week. Penn State is at number 21, two good wins and two losses. And Liberty is your last team, one good win and one loss with that win over Arkansas yesterday. Remember, these are not who I believe are the best teams in the nation. This is just a resume ranking. And you can see a little preview right here of the three teams who I think are the best in the nation stay tuned for that video that will be coming out later today and uh, remember to like share subscribe and have a great day everybody thank you